All right, YouTube, welcome back to another hog hunting video with Bobby Hills Outdoors. Me and Jesse are gonna head on out here to the uh, cornfields, see if we can see some hogs moving. It's been a couple weeks, so see what's out there. Gonna be using the Trail XP50, and also have a Pulsar Trail XP50 LRF laser rangefinder, and still using the Axion handheld unit from Pulsar and a Helion. So y'all stay tuned, see if we can get some pigs on the ground tonight. It's a little wet, been raining, so gotta kinda navigate real easy out there. Y'all stay tuned. All right, what's up, man? We got down here to the river bottom. As soon as we cornered the corn, we uh, saw a bunch of pigs, they ran off. We turned the call on and uh, was able to call a couple more back in. It looked like a, a boar mountain of sow out there playing around anyways. So they came back in, uh, we got a shot on them on the road. I think I got one down and turned around right after we shot and me and Jesse took one other uh, looked like a lone board down here next to the corn row took it out dropped him so we'll go down here in the road get this one and then we'll come back and get the other one wait 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 let's get them right now one I'm gonna get the one in the back one two three right here right here He's right here. Alright, so I'm having to reload. I went and checked on that other pig that we got right on the edge of the corn. There was another pig standing over there. Checking him out. Checking his old dead ass out. So I ran back, got my rifle. Took a shot on him. Missed him. He ran off in the corn. Came back. Just crashed through the back of the truck behind the corn caught him dropped him right there you can see in the thermal video i i wounded him in the back and then I, I killed him on the side of the road anyways we're gonna go back there and get him gotta reload man run out of ammo we're getting her done it's all about that hog life right there official sponsor of bobby hills outdoors right now we're gonna see how wet it is out here see if we can drive up this hog i am tearing it up pretty good in here hitting all this corn out here Hitting the corn where the pig is. The truck, let me get off in here. Looking good out here, that corn. Plenty of hogs to kill. Here's the little, here's the little boar. Yeah, little boar. He didn't make it, man. He died in the corn. Yeah. He gonna destroy no more corn for that fella. No. <laughs> He's done. There's his corn all the way down there. Corn all the way down there. <laughs> Thought it was a wall, so man. You, yeah, Bobby Hill, that was real coming. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like Bill Dance out here. Yeah. I thought it was a damn it bee, was man. Heavy. It was a, pretty heavy. Never know when a bee be flying around in the middle of the night. All right, so we got this other pig. This other one I took out on the road. He's right over here. Got him on the edge of the corn. We'll get him loaded up. Yeah. He's just playing possum. Got some cutters. I had to winch him, Damn. which yeah. is pretty, work out pretty good. Yeah. Big old river monster right there. He got some little teeth. That's a good pig though. I guess didn't get the other one. I uh, gotta get the winch out because this one is a beast. So, get it on. Let's see what she's talking about. I guess a little teeth. Alright. Oh, Pour that 
Winch was a lifesaver on that one, wasn't it? Yeah. There's some little teeth. Too bad. Getting her done. I'm going to shoot one one day. Yeah. We'll get it all together. So, Guns and Chicken Strips calls it when he's hunting with me. Starch. Starch. That's what he says. <laughs> Man, is that starch? It's the same <laughs> bottle. <laughs> Glass cleaner. Anyways, we're going to get out of here. Go donate these pigs. I've got some little cutters right there. But They're pretty good. All nuts. So we're going to call tonight. Try to get out of here without killing any more hogs because they seem to be moving pretty good. Yeah, they're moving pretty good. That's my boars. We got the, uh, Jesse's using the Trail XP50 LRF. And I'm using the the Trail XP50 uh, by Pulsar. They're both Pulsar thermals. Got to thank my friends over there at Pulsar sending me this, uh, the LRF to try out. Anyways, Jesse uh, still using the Axion there. The uh, XM38 Axion. Pulsar, uh, they've also sent that to me to try out. We've been uh, we've been using it. Spot some pretty good pigs with it. Anyways, I'm using the Helion uh, XP28 with a F50 lens on it, and uh, that's it, man. We got three hogs. It's better than nothing. We thought we were gonna get skunked out, and then we found the pecan orchard back there. It did pretty good, man. What you think? Yeah, yeah. They're always in the pecans. Last, last straw. Last straw. Anyways, we're gonna get out of here. Y'all don't forget to go get y'all's hog life apparel right there at getoutdoorcrew.com or Facebook or Instagram to get you hooked up. We got all kind of hats, shirts, and all that stuff. So if you're uh, if you're about that hog life right there, bam, go hit him up, man. That's uh, Jesse's got him a hat. He's uh, he's not wearing it right no, now. Today. But he was wearing it the other day. <laughs> Anyways, we got plenty of hats and shirts. Anyways, y'all go check them out. Uh, you can also uh, purchase them at Cabela's and Bass Pro Shops, I believe, around uh, Texas areas. So anyways, y'all, thanks for watching this episode of Bobby Hills Outdoors. And uh, if you hadn't already hit that subscribe button, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the little bell right next to it. Let you know next time I upload a new video. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Y'all, thanks for watching this episode.